Yo, so what happened in there, man? Break man. it down for us. So, you know, it's heated, man. You know, we team Paul. We rep our guy, man. Of it kind of just was got a little out of hand, man. He, T, uh, T. Willie's mom was sitting in the row actually behind me. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, I, I yelled out a chant. I said, you know, we got team Paul in here. Mm -hmm. And uh, she kind of, like, shot back at me. was like... Uh, he got, well, T. Willie got his mama in here. Oh, yeah, I yeah, heard that. I heard that. And then I just kind of, you know, I was joking. You know, we joke, we have fun, man. Yeah, this yeah. is a presser, man. I said, this ain't third grade no more. <laughs> you know what I mean? This ain't third grade no more. You know what I mean? So she, the, everyone laughed. She got a little, that one that one right there kind of hit her a little bit. And then she kind of got reckless and she started disrespecting me. Mm. And then, you know, sisters and cousins and I don't know who else was involved, but they, you know, they kind of surrounded me and turned into something that shouldn't have turned into. But it didn't start, it didn't start off as he, like, y'all was just having fun. Was he was having fun, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? I'm like, you know, Team Paul in here. She yeah. like, you know, Mama Willie in here. And I, I didn't mean to disrespect her, you know what I'm saying? I have the most respect for women. I have a mother myself. I got two moms at that, you know what I mean? So, raised by women, so it was never that. And, you know what I'm saying? We just gonna get to Sunday, you know what I mean? I'm not I'm not gonna apologize, I didn't do nothing wrong. Yeah. That's how I feel. Yeah. You know what I mean? But we get to Sunday, it's war, man. Hopefully it's started up, man. Hopefully everybody tuning in now, yeah. you know what I mean? I didn't want it to be the best, you know, on Women's Day, National Women's Day. I didn't want that to be kind of the situation, but. Of course. Were, were, you, you, know I mean? were you surprised to see it, like, pop yeah. off the you know, way? I mean, Tyron it's, came down. And it's it crazy because I was literally, I stood up and I just removed myself. Even you can see in the videos, I'm sitting there. I'm not I'm not going to stand up in a woman's face. Right. You know what I mean? I'm not going to approach her. I'm not going to. It's, it's not even that situation. I wasn't trying to take it there. So. I, probably, I was the first one out of there before it got crazy. I probably was the first one. You know what I mean? I'm not here for that, man. I, uh, you know what I mean? Lead the street stuff in the streets, man. Yeah. This is a press conference. We got to handle stuff professionally. And like like I said, like, you know what I mean? It could have been different actions taken from both sides. You know what I mean? So mm -hmm. it just is what it is. I, uh, I hope I hope he come out with some fire in his tank. I hope he used that because my boy Jake is ready, prepared, and we're going to get the job done Sunday regardless. You know yeah, what I mean? so, yeah. At the end of the day, all that stuff's behind y'all. It's behind us, man. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I love all moms in the whole world. I love all the – I respect my elders. I respect my – you know what I mean? It, it, it was never supposed to go there, man. I'm, I, I apologize to the world who sees me in a different light of disrespecting my own like that. I'm getting messages. I'm like, man, this is crazy. Yeah. You know what I mean? I didn't even see – y'all don't know what happened. Y'all caught in that one glimpse of someone saying, you disrespected my mom. I'm like, right. come on, man. You got to know what happened before you just see what you see, man. Yeah. So, it's, it's that old whoever says it first. That's you know that's what, I mean? what the truth is. Where, yeah. Whatever hit the internet first, they want yeah. to take it around with it. So real quick before you get out of here, I, I did want to ask you. Just, uh, I mean, obviously you're you're all about the strength and conditioning. Just how strong is Jake Paul? I mean, I know we joke he's from Ohio. He got that country man, boy strength this and man everything. Is but strong as hell. Mm -hmm. You know, it's crazy. We we took the weight room out of it this camp. I mean, oh, really? Usually we were, when we were in Vegas, we were going to um, phase one and doing some lifting and stuff. And kind of this camp, we been man, we took it. Even in Miami, you had a little weight room stuff. But this camp, man, Puerto Rico, we took it real natural, man. We was out there on the beach, push-ups, dips, yeah. you know what I mean? Natural stuff, man. You know, this guy's just naturally strong, you know what I mean? And yeah. he likes the... the, the he, he don't he don't really need you know what I mean he's like a he's like Tarzan man he don't need much to get strong I mean to juggle coconuts and do some push ups and he ready you know what I mean so yeah. he likes that kind of like that 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 like a like natural natural you know yeah. what I mean natural just sit us push us pull ups and just kill him and just go hard and, and until he can't do no more you know what I mean so yeah. This camp, we took a different different approach, but you can see his body's changing tremendously, man. Mm -hmm. From three years, he's way stronger, way faster. I mean, we just we just stay on the little things, consistency, yeah. consistently, man. Just making working those little muscles, making sure his abs are strong, making sure his condition is right, running. Mm -hmm. Man, this dude's gonna be ready, man. I, I can tell you that he's, he's yeah. more than ready. That's gonna be more beneficial for actually boxing inside the ring, as you know opposed I mean? to you know Tyron's like he's jacked. Yeah, Tyron. <laughs> jacked. I mean, he in there squatting and doing the wrong stuff. That's kind of counterproductive to what you do in the ring. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? In the ring, you everything's natural flow state. So that's why we kind of moved into these more natural movements and balance and things like that and rhythm and working on things like that. You know what I mean? Because mm -hmm. Jake is naturally powerful. Yeah. He was born powerful, so yeah. you know what I mean. I don't know what Ohio got in a in, in a food out it's here. It's the so. milk. It's the milk it's and the, the cows. Milk. That's what he said. The milk. So yeah, <laughs> that boy, man, putting out sparring partners who actually are better than Tyron, if you ask mm. ask me. So mm. 
Man, we're more than prepared, man. He's done everything correctly. That's what's up. Well, obviously, I know you're expecting a victory. Do you have a prediction as far as it's going to go the distance, going to get a knockout? I'm, I'm, feel, I'm feeling knockout. I know okay. Tyron going to come with some heat under his belt. Which Especially like. now. Well, I hopefully, he got, <laughs> hopefully he fired up. Hopefully he's watching this still mad. And mm. I ain't say sorry because I'm not. Mm. And uh, you know what I mean? Hopefully he come out with some – use that as a hammer. But we ready. That's mm. all I can say. We ready. I'm thinking – First, second round, Ooh. Jake pops him with something hard, maybe a hard overhand right or something like that. Mm. You go, the man's gonna be rushing. He's gonna be out of there mentally. I don't think I don't see him being a calm boxer. You know, it's new for him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Jake gonna pop him second round. By the second round, something hard, mm. put him down. That's what's up. Cleveland what's goes up. crazy. You know what I mean? Hometown, and we celebrating after that. You know, you get the tattoo, and we can move past On to the after party. On to the after party. <laughs> Tyron be in the, in the after party with his tattoo. We be friends. <laughs> we be friends after that. You know what I mean? That's what's up. That's yes, what's up. Sir. Let the fans know where they can follow you and check out some. Because I know you, I know you do a lot more than than, than yeah, working man, with Jake Paul. Doing music, man. Doing entertainment. It's crazy. Three. It's a three year journey with Jake. We actually met organically through. You know, music and entertainment and stuff. Oh, that's and, crazy. And, and he just decided. When I was the first box match, he was like, "I'm gonna fight Soldier Boy," and we was joking <laughs> and we was gonna train for that. And look at him now, man. High, one of the highest paid boxers out here. You know, pro serious fights. And we just went on this journey for three years and locked in. So you can find me on Instagram, Pick Six. I go by D Cut. Yeah, let's get it. That's what's up.